Hi, Mark and Katie. Uh, it's Chris Reed here from Ardor SEO, and I've put together this short video audit to show you a few of the things that you're doing spectacularly well with your website and a huge potential that's still available. Uh, during the email, we were talking about PromGirl, so I've used them as a demonstration of the huge potential that is still available for your website. So the first thing I've done is gone over to a tool to see how well you're ranking. And so I can see here that you rank for around 7,700 keywords, which is you know, a fantastic start. And that generates you around 8,700 visitors every single day. So good job. And that traffic, uh, if you bought it all with Google AdWords, would cost a whooping $4,600. So that's a lot of real free traffic. Uh, and I can see that over the last two years, you've really gone up a lot, you know, from around 2,000 visitors, then up to like 5,000 visitors, then up to 9,000 visitors, you know, and that, that's around where you are today, which is, you know, an excellent start. And if we divide that, if we divide that up, so if you've got 8,700 visitors and you divide that by 7,700 keywords, that means you're getting 1.1 visitors per keyword, which uh, isn't that great. If we go over to look at uh, look at Promgirl, we can see that you know they rank for a ridiculous amount, 133,000 keywords that they generate 2.6 visitors per keyword. So uh, uh, 2.6 million visitors. Sorry, there's uh, there's a bit of construction going on next door and it's driving me uh, mental. I hope it's not too distracting for you. So you've got 1.1 visitor for, per keyword. Where if we throw in there 2.6 million divided by 133,000, you get 19 visitors per keyword, which is just a huge amount more. And the way that the reason that is is the way that uh, the click-through rate is distributed through where you're where you're positioned. So here is an analysis of how that is distributed. So if if you're on page two, you're going 4% of the of people go to page two, and then that's divided by the 10 results there. You can see here almost 4% click on between six and 10. Then as we move up, uh, you know, nearly 10% click on position three, 14 position, people click, 14% click on position two, and a whooping 31% click on position one. So even moving from position two to position one, is going to double your traffic for that keyword. So what this tells me is that there's so many keywords that you're just way too far down for you, either on position on page two or three, or just at the bottom of the top 10. And so we can see here are the, are the positions of your keywords, and these are, I've got them ranked by position. So you can see all these ones that you position too. So like this one here, color dresses, you know, there's 480 searches a month for that, and you're in position two. So you're going to get uh, 14%. Moving that one forward, you're going to get 31% of that. So that's a that's a huge difference. So how the fundamentals of how Google work, right? Yes, they look at your website and they look at your content. But if two websites were exactly the same, you know, had beautiful websites with beautiful content that load fast and had great great everything, then it comes down to authority, you know, because they can't inherently trust what you say. They have to look at the greater community and what everyone else is saying about you too. And so that comes through backlinks, other websites linking to your website. And so we can see here that you've got a trust flow of six, which is actually really very low. Uh, so you, you're ranking very well for a trust flow of six. And I don't know if you've been working with an SEO company previously, but I, I dare say that there might be something a little bit suspicious going on because your citation flow, your trust flow is basically your authority, how much, uh, how powerful the links are that are linking to you. And your citation flow is how much link juice is pushing through those links. And these numbers should generally be very uh, close to each other within 10 to 20% uh, margin of difference uh, and anything that's out is a little suspicious so I would say that there could perhaps be some negative links that are even holding you back 
or something going on. So I'd really look at which, what are these AD domains are linking to. But if we go and look over at Promgo, we can see that they have a trust flow of 54, which is massive. And you can see that their citation flow with, is in, what's that, uh, just over 10% dif difference. And having, that's having a trust flow higher than a citation flow, which is even better. And that comes because they've got a whooping 3,924 uh, <laughs> domains linking to them, which is massive. So, you know, Katie and Mark, without touching your website, without worrying about, you know, how your site's structured or your content or doing metadata or seeing how fast it loads, without doing anything, just by adding backlinks to your website, it'll increase, it'll move all of those keywords that are on page two and three, four up to page one and all of those keywords that are already on page one a lot higher. So that's really the first thing that I'd focus on, building the authority of your brand and the trust that, that you have with Google and move up for all of those keywords. So who am I anyway? Well, that's me right there. I'm Chris Reed, the CEO and founder of Ardor SEO. And we specialize in working with com uh, companies just like yours to drive thousands of more visitors to their website each and every month. And you know, we know at the end of the day, no one cares about search engine rankings and no one really cares about traffic. They care about new customers. And so that's exactly what we focus on. Make sure that people, the right people are finding your website, getting to your website and taking action. So if you'd like me to put together a strategy to show you how we can generate thousands more uh, visitors to your website each and every day, all you need to do is click the button below this video. It'll pop up my calendar just find a date and time that suits you and book in a call. Some questions I'd like you to ask yourself before we have a chat though, is you know, what's your average customer worth to you? Uh, what's your current conversion rate from your website? You know, and what would 10,000 extra visitors a day do for your business? Uh, anyway, Katie and Mark, I hope you found that really interesting and enjoyable and I hope you'll be booking in a call and we get to speak really soon. So thank you very much for your time and have a great day. Bye-bye.